Hey guys, what's up? KSK Rahul here and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, I will show you how to install Windows 10 on any PC very easily. This guide is exclusively made for beginners or novices. If you have built your new PC and you don't know how to install Windows on it, then this guide will help you to install it properly. Also following this guide will help the users if they wanted to reinstall the Windows 10 as a fresh copy on the PC. I will show you a step-by-step -step procedure of installing Windows 10 on any PC in an easiest way as possible. You can use any Windows, but I am using a Windows 10 for the demonstration purpose. The prerequisites for this video, you need a Windows DVD or bootable USB. Also in this video, we will be installing a Windows 10 using the legacy BIOS on MBR partition map. Most of all the motherboard supports a legacy BIOS installation. You can also use UEFI GPT mapping, but personally I recommend you can install Windows 10 using the legacy BIOS and MBR partition scheme. If you want to know more information about the UEFI GPT and MBR and BIOS, check the links in the description box down below. Alright, so let's begin. Go ahead and hook up the bootable USB or Windows DVD to your PC. Then turn on your PC. While turning on, we need first to boot your PC into the BIOS mode. Pressing the F2 on most of the computers helps to boot into the BIOS mode. Here in BIOS, we need to modify some settings. As I said, we will be using the legacy BIOS interface, which means if your motherboard has UEFI turned on by default, make sure turn it off and turn on legacy BIOS option. Then save the changes. Now your PC will boot into the Windows setup automatically. Now when you are inside the setup, choose your language country and region then select and click on next then click on install now type a product key if you have i will go with the trial period then click on next here you need to choose a which flavor of windows 10 to be installed on your pc now click on next and accept the license agreement then choose custom installation method now here all of your drives connected to your pc will be shown if you don't see your entire drive with an unallocated space then we need to format and configure it using the command prompt. For this, hold Shift plus F10, which will launch the command prompt. Here you need to type a few commands. First type disk part, then type list disk. Here all of the drives connected to your PC will be shown. Select the appropriate disk to install Windows on it. In my case, I will be installing Windows 10 on disk 0, so I'm going to select it. For this selection, select disk and the disk number in my case is disk 0. Then type list disk to ensure the correct disk is selected. Now we need to format it. All of the data on the disk will be gone. Make a backup if you have anything. Then type clean or format it. Now type convert MBR to set the MBR partition scheme to the disk. If you have booted your hard drive using the UEFI, then type convert GPT. Since we have booted the PC using the BIOS interface, we will set a MBR partition mapping to the hard drive. Now type exit to exit the disk part and then type again exit to exit the command prompt. Now click on refresh button here. You will now see a fully unallocated space of your hard drive. Select the unallocated space and then click on new. Then click on OK to format your drive. Now select the second big partition which is where the windows will be installed. The first partition used by system which is where all the bootloader information is stored. Select the second partition then click on next to begin the installation. Now leave your PC for a few minutes to complete the installation process. Once the installation is done, your PC will automatically restart. Now take out of your DVD or bootable USB. Give some time Windows to boot and that's it. This is how we can install Windows 10 on any PC. 
If you have any suggestions for any future videos, do let me know in the comment section box down below. Thank you so much for watching. This is your host KSK Ryle signing off.